But even go on. The question is, but like, if you know something is mitya, then you know, does this dissolution even matter? So, if you know entity as mitya, huh. does the dissolution matter? The question is, entire world is mitya, even a point is mitya. Is the dissolution matters? It doesn't dissolve. <laughs> There's nothing called dissolution. You are finding that identity with the original. I'll put it this way. A gold and necklace are not two separate entities. I cannot buy a necklace. I can buy a gold. Gold only is brought in the form of necklace. So when you are Brahman, the point is with one Brahman. It's a gold necklace is there. So there's no dissolution in the sense disappearance. Entire world becomes Brahman. <laughs> Water, wave and ocean. Wave is trying to say, I am water. Finally, it recognizes I am water. Wave doesn't have to dissolve. Yeah. Wave says, I am water. In the water, I am only appearing as wave. Okay, I am only appearing as wave. Okay, so, so this is the dissolution of the idea that I am separate. Not the point separation, point dissolution. The sense of separation drops. Okay. The question, the of the no, no. no, no, I'm saying the point, ultimately I have to drop the point to realize I'm one with the universal consciousness. Right? See, the, even in the point, when you're observing the point, there's a sense of subject and object. When the su I am the Atma, I am Brahman, focus, looking at the point. Subject, object, divided is there. So the dissolution of the point does not mean subject, the point dissolves. The point is dissolve, recognized as appearance in me. I am only appearing as point. I am only appearing as universe. So the sense of somebody is observing the sense of individual identity dissolves. So that is not there even in the regular day to day. I am saying if there is not there, the question itself will not come now. So, see. <laughs> somewhere the conflict is there. Somewhere the, see, you are saying, your Jagat is Mithya, I have understood. So then, for you there is nowhere to go. Nothing to do. Right, but still you feel there is nothing, something to do. I'm saying, oh, I want to show Vedanta, Jagat is Mithya. Okay, there's no nowhere to go. All those you understood, but still, I am not satisfied. The trapti has not happened. Okay, still, what you are understanding is at a conceptual level. <laughs> I'm saying, as long as the concept dissolves, slightest idea of a dual dissolves, the trapti doesn't happen. So you may say consciously I have no, I have dissolved it. Subconsciously the sense of separation is hiding. <laughs> so where the entire world has to appear as me. See, uh, me means the, it, it is like this. Uh, there is now I am there and God is there. Individual. I am seeking. So gradually identity shifts. I am pure awareness. I am Sakshi. I am looking at a world. So I am looking at the world also dissolves because the world and I are not separate. So there's only one reality, which is Advaita, non-dual. It doesn't require the world to disappear. The gold does not require necklace to disappear. The gold understands I am necklace. Perspective of the whole thing changes. So in that perspective in change, so when you're starting, you're saying the world is there and world is Mithya. Brahma Satya, Brahma Satya, Jagat Mithya. Jagat Mithya means not discarding the world. Discarding, giving a lot of attention to the world. Thinking change in the worldly object. Then you go to Brahman. I am holding on to Brahman. Now you only become Brahman. Then you recognize that entire world is Brahman. You have nothing to discard. What you discard earlier as Mithya is nothing but my own appearance. That's where Aham Brahmasmi, Sarvam Khalidh Brahma, both will appear. Then the first thing... Uh... Why is any giving attention to the world? This, this much is understood. When the duality collapses, you don't have anything to discard because everything is Brahman only. Understood? Everything is Brahman only. So earlier your Jagat is told as Mithya because you are too much giving attention to objects. Without understanding, the objects are not separate from Osh, oh, oh, Brahman. Now once you recognize you are Brahman and the world is Brahman, there is nothing for you to chase. There is no problem. It's problem itself dissolved. Is this much understood? Okay. The world is Brahman doesn't mean the world has to disappear. 
once you understand rope is nothing but snake snake is snake you understand it's rope only look at the world i understand i am brahman only Bra world is brahman only world doesn't disappear in enlightenment world is appears as brahman myself self only of course after death there's no world but with the eyes open for nani the world is brahman this is clear so the the waking state is called considered as a dream in the dream when you wake up the waking dream world disappears but in nan atma dnana when you wake up the dream world the maya appears as brahman i am brahman this is it and everything is brahman this is much understood so even if a slightest subconscious unconscious hidden sense of separation is there tripti will not come fully but but it'll keep coming out and you just have to like take attention back to that's the whole journey yeah. become aware of that right ultimately you have to get rid of that sense of yeah. because our conscious mind is only 5% subconscious and unconscious mind is deeper so hidden is something hidden deep inside the sense of separation is there you have to surface are okay so let's close this question so your question last question i'll answer and then